Today we're going to be changing the oil and the oil filter in this KLX, so let's get to it. What's going on everybody? We got a little bit of a different vehicle here on the channel. This is a KLX 250 and we're doing an oil change here. So, got a 14 millimeter, drain the oil and tilt the bike back and forth, make sure Got it level and drain. Remove the filler plug to give it a vent to drain out easier. Then we're also going to replace the filter. Just remove these two bolts here. When there is a spring in there you have to watch out for. There's a mod for that, I'll show you. Or a trick, rather. Just wanna loosen this end up so it fits right in the hole in there. So it fits snug in there. We're gonna loosen it a little more. Just gonna do a little spring modification. All right, so I'm just gonna widen one to the spring so it doesn't come out of those tabs when I pull the filter out when I change it in the next time. All right, we're gonna get some dielectric grease and stick in here for this rubber seal. That'll hold it in place for us. Then just stick your new filter back on, slip it back in. All right, slide that back in, and then we're gonna tighten it back down. And then wipe up any excess silicone grease that squeezed out and on down to the oil. I'm gonna replace the drain plug, tighten that back down, and then we're gonna get a funnel, and this uses this uses 1040 motorcycle oil. It is just over one quart, so it is 1.2 when you change it with the filter, so it's just over a quart. So go ahead and dump a whole quart in there and check it. Got a little sight glass here at the bottom of the engine and a foot brake and then just hold the bike up level. Check that sight glass and it should be between those two marks. Alright, so we're going to start it up, let it idle for a minute or two, get the oil working around through that new filter we got. Then we're going to shut it off, let it sit for a minute and then recheck that oil level. All right, so just a little bit to top it off. We rechecked the oil. We've got it in between the marks there, and we're good to go riding again. I hope you found this video helpful. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.